Hello there, this is uh, me again. It's I'm back here with a quick update um, about using the Nail Envy, the soft and thin formula. I've been using this now since Friday last week, so today's day seven where you take it all off and reapply and start again. Uh, so I'm just showing you my nails now after a week. Um, I've taken all the nail polish off. I've not got any cuticle oil on or anything, so they do look a bit dry because of that. Um, I've managed to not break any nails, but they are still really weak, really soft and bendy. Um, I think what I'm going to do, because they really feel like they're going to break, because you know they, they are still thin, I don't think anything will happen with the old nail that's already grown. Uh, so I think I'm going to trim them down this week and then I'm going to continue using the Nail Envy and use it as a base coat under nail polish because I can't stand not having nail polish on it's doing my head in <laughs> I had like five days with no nail polish on just a Nail Envy it looked really nice though it was really shiny and everything um, but yeah so from today I'm going to be redoing my nails and every time I redo my nails I'm going to put two coats of Nail Envy on as a base um, <clears throat> so hopefully any new nail that grows will be stronger and I've been rubbing oil into my cuticles I've uh, just bought some olive oil, I've heard olive oil is really good so I've bought a bottle of olive oil and I've put it into some old nail polish bottles I've got one in my work bag, one in my, both my handbags at home and uh, one just to hand when I'm sat watching the TV and I keep rubbing it in, it's, it's quite nice actually, I like it um so yeah i'll try and get a well hopefully if i'll stay in focus um i'll get a better close-up see how they're going so far this one here keeps uh, snagging i've had to file it a couple of times but yeah it's getting quite long but like i said they're still really soft so i need to trim these these thin edges off um i mean you can see from the line when i had um some acrylics and or something there you can see i mean that's no nail since then and that no nail looks a lot better so hopefully when that gets down there it should be stronger hopefully <laughs> if i can uh, stop obviously i'm not going to be filing them like i do when i do acrylics you can see here all the damage to my nail with using acrylics and i'm terrible for picking it off there as well so yeah all that is damaged to the nails so i need to get rid of that and uh, you know, I think each nail is the same, they'll look all right here. And then the ends are a mess because of the abuse, I should call it, that I've given them. So yeah, I'm uh, quite pleased with the progress so far. Um lost focus again. Does it want to come back? No, I need to get an OSD card for my old camera because this mobile phone is not very good for filming. It doesn't stay in focus, unfortunately. Try again. No. Oh, yeah, no, there it is. That's better. So, yeah, but like if you look at my nails this way on, they're like, I bet they're only about a millimetre thick. They're terrible. They're really, really thin. Really, really thin. So, yeah, but like I say, if I carry on with my plan, as I've said, and using the Nail Envy as a, you know, two layers every time I change my nail polish, hopefully that will do them good, and I'm going to keep up with the uh, cuticle oil and get some moisture back into these nails. So, yeah, so, I, mean, I, I mean, it'll be months and months before I can say if... They are, it has made a change. I will probably do updates every now and again and let you know, you know, show you my naked nails. I suppose that's what you can call them, naked nails. Um, and let you know how they're feeling and let you know if they do feel like they're getting stronger. So, but that's, that's it for now. So thanks for watching and um, I'll see you later. Bye.